taking the kayak quite a bit different from the first meeting. I asked you before I turn this on, Kai, I'm going to get you to talk about Tegan. She didn't play in the first game. How big a difference was it having her back out there? Well, Tegan's our main point guard. It's always a big help to have your main point guard back. And Tegan's really fast, so she gets us going. She gets us up and down the court. She gets our energy high. Tegan took three charges in this game, and that was a really big help with our energy and getting us going and getting us this win. She's a pretty good PR piece of person for you, Tegan. But talk about what it was like to be back out there and what you felt like you needed to do to make an impact. Um, I felt like just our energy and communicating on the court to help my teammates. You know, since I'm the point guard, like my teammates need help organizing and our plays on offense, which really helps me actually run offense. <laughs> Defense was a big difference too. McKaylin had a really good game against y'all the first time she shot. Had a lot of shots tonight, but y'all defended her, I don't know if it was differently, better, both. Which was it? Well, we put Janaylee on her this time, and we know Janaylee has that length. And McKaylin's a really good player. She's 5'11", so we know she has that length, and she's really good about using her body. But Janaylee's a really good defender for bigger people, taller people, and we know we could rely on her, and she did her job today. The last time I saw you I think was Monterey mm -hmm. and I'm going to guess that game is kind of a sore spot for you guys not just losing but being on the wrong side of a, a historical performance yeah. you've, you've played better since then you played Cooper well tonight did that game kind of give you guys some motivation to kind of get back on track right. just to get our stuff together and get back to what we love yeah we're really uh focused on not being a roller coaster team, so having a really good game and then kind of dipping. So the fact that we played Cooper really well and we know what we're capable of, the fact that we knew we had to keep going and not take that roller coaster, take that dip, and keep going is really on our mindset. Five games left, am I right? In the district? What do you have to do to keep headed in the right direction? We just have we have to practice hard. We have to keep our practices good. We have to talk. We have to communicate. And we just have to rely on each other and talk. Energy and communication.